Hello everybody. If you're having problem with the Guardian, either it's not showing up or it's kind of wobbly, it feels it's not accurate, uh, there are a few things you can actually do. Now, one of the most important thing is first make sure you define the Guardian. And in general, if you use the VR headset, you do it in a well-lit room. So if you're doing it in a dark or relatively dark area, you're probably going to find other issues, not just with the Guardian, but with the tracking of the VR headset in general. Now, the MetaQuest 2 does have different options for the Guardian, but none of them actually uh, will solve the issue of inaccuracy. Now, the MetaQuest 2 has different options for you, but the things regarding sensitivity, changing the flow levels, etc. But if you're having problem with tracking or you see something wobbly, you need to solve it in a different way. What I do recommend first is, again, as I told you, first be in a well-lit area. Second, make sure to restart your headset and see if it works. That's the simplest solution that might work for you. you just turn the headset off, turn it on, or just restart it and see if the problem is solved. Now, second thing I recommend setting the floor height again. Even if you already define it, define it again and make sure you touch with the controller on the floor and set the floor uh, location. So again, set the floor level and check it out if it works for you. Another thing you can do, of course, is check out that you have the latest version installed. Sometimes, of course, bugs are fixed uh, in uh, the latest system update. So make sure, of course, to update your Oculus Meta Quest 2 to the latest firmware. You do this by going to the settings sections and clicking system, and then you're going to see an option to update the software. I have made a video of this on my channel, so just search my channel for Quest 2 system update, and you're going to find it. Now, I'm not sure this one will work, but try. Uh, if you're playing on, if you're playing on a very, very flat, uh, one color surface, try putting something that give more contrast. Like for example, a little rug, something that have more textures and have different contrast, you know, areas in it and try to see if it works for you. Another thing I recommend is just trying to draw. If you are playing in room scale to draw the guardian in a smaller area and Again, if everything don't work, I recommend also checking out the sensitivity of the Guardian uh, to just make everything by default, right? So if you play with different settings, try to set everything by default and see if it works for you. Now, some of you might be creating content uh, in VR and if you connect, connect it, for example, uh, your Oculus Quest 2 uh, to your PC and to your side quest, and uh, you kind of add ADB commands, uh, you know, for example, changing the recording resolution uh, and other type of settings, which are not the default one for the MetaQuest. Uh, you modify them, try to, again, restarting your headset. So because all of these settings will actually be uh, removed once you restart the headset. Again, this is just go back to the same reset options. But if you reset again and use the uh, side quest to do some ADB commands, on your headset to increase the recording resolution, this might be, be causing issues. So the first thing you need to do is just to eliminate all the problems. So if you do a restart of your headset, well, and you're not doing anything after just checking the Guardian, this is the best thing to do first. Uh, and don't do anything with SideQuest or other type of sideloading app that can actually, uh, you know, and other type of software that can do ADB commands and change the settings of the headset externally. Another thing I recommend is checking that the cameras of the Oculus Quest 2 headset in the front ones, uh, as you can see, are actually clean. Maybe they are dirty, make sure you check it out. Now, of course, there might be an issue with the headset, but usually it's not. Uh, usually this is something that you can actually solve, and I hope some of these things can actually uh, help you with. Uh, if you are really having really issues, you can really solve it, you can do a factory reset. Just keep in mind that everything on your headset will be erased. And of course, also make sure that nothing actually blocks the camera. Some people put things to protect the headset and maybe kind of an accessory that can actually block the camera or something, you know, so make sure it's not even broken. Uh, yeah, and that's it. That's uh, all my ideas I have for you. But if you have anything that works for you that ever wasn't mentioned here, let us know in the comment section below so others will know this, uh, how to solve this as well. Uh, and consider leaving a like and subscribe to my channel. I see you very soon in the next video. I love VR and of course, much more content will come regarding VR uh, very, very soon. So again, thanks for watching. I see you in the next video. Cheers and good luck.